While the British watch the Germans, the Italians patrol the shores of Austria, holding the Mediterranean sea lanes open for troop ships and food to pass. Destroyers conceal troop ships behind smoke screens, hazardous work, for there are many enemy submarines beneath these blue waters. Along the Austrian coast, the Italians engage shore batteries. Sea raids here are nothing new. Turrets swing shoreward, and shell after shell falls into the coastal cities. Durazzo, Italian metal. Meanwhile, the French steam out of Algiers to join a British squadron. The orders are secret. Only the commanders know their target is the Dardanelles. The German submarine falls upon the fleet. Suddenly a periscope is sighted. Torpedo boat destroyers go into action. Deck guns begin firing. Depth charges are dropped. and the enemy disappears. The Hellespont lies at the end of the cruise, where Leander knew the currents and the Greeks from Aulis and many other warriors. With battle flags at topmast, the British and French begin to shell the Turkish defenses. are landing to spill their blood in a venture that failed. 